Hello and welcome to uh, this episode of the Krakowia Career. Uh, last episode was pretty great. We started off with the loss. It was a rotated team, fully rotated team. Um, but then we, I guess it was worth it, you could say, because we managed to beat Atletico Madrid away from home and beat Legia quite convincingly. Um, this episode we got Jagiellonia, Atletico again, and uh, Vizsla Krakow. So we're, we're playing rivals and Madrid. Uh, we're currently sat in 7th. Vizsla Krakow are uh, on 21 points. They'll probably be on 24 um, by the end of this game week. They have not played yet. Interesting because I'm pretty sure last season they finished like well down, like below us. Uh, so it's good they've, well, maybe not good they've turned it around, but congrats on them for turning it around. We're currently 6 points off top means we're still in it, we've still got plenty of the season left to play, but we got to stop rotating, we've got to stop losing these games that we, we could win with our first team. we just got to go in with our best players and hope that we can still play our better players in the uh, the bigger games. Holovinia and Pienczak will go out on short loans at the beginning of the transfer window. Vidoviak would like to play. I suppose with uh, Teletico coming on, we could rotate that one position. The only thing I'd say is like Baran and Komen, the two people he could come in for, both probably aren't going to start, so they should probably be starting here. So really, I kind of want to do like Alvarez. Could he play up front? No. Baran could though. What if we do that? What if we just give Baran a go up front and see what happens? All right, well, yeah, so that will be the team we go in with, I think. Yeah. That should be fine. Playing in the snow today, that should be fun. This ought to be a terrific spectacle, Lee. Thanks, Derek. Look at that. Both managers will be that that's a lot of space for Van Amersfoort. Boom. Four minutes in. I'm, I'm pretty sure it was like three minutes in we got the goal. In the last one, Rivaldinho gets a goal finally. He was only getting assists at the, uh, in the last episode. But he gets a goal. Van Amersfoort with the assist. That defender not doing well enough. Are we going for another high-scoring game? I think so. Oh, that's a goal, isn't it? Good save. Good save. Great tackle. Oh, come on. Rivaldinho kept it, though. Going to wait. Van Amersfoort doesn't go to him. Goes instead. Oh, yes. Baran, I think, with the goal. Assisted by God knows who. I have no idea who that was. Komen? Was it Komen? I think it might have been Komen. Yeah, because it goes to Komen instead of Van Amersfoort. Yeah, that's yeah, that's number 18, yeah. Komen with the assist. Baran gets the goal. We're in the 65th minute. I'm going to bring off Rivaldinho for Adam Schitsch and Baran for Vrobel. I just don't want uh, the players that I know are going to be important to be fit in the next episode, in the next game, sorry, uh, to uh, be tired. So also bring off Novak as well. Is Adam Schitt. Adam Schitt finishes. That was very easy finish for him. Honestly, he's lower rated than Robbo, but he just he seems better. And this game ends 3-0. Pretty comfortable. They did have chances. This could have gone either way, uh, but we we finished ours and uh, uh, we managed to rest some players along the way, uh, bringing off certain players because we were comfortable. So I'd call that definitely a success. I mean, actually, <laughs> maybe it was a bit more comfortable than I'm letting on. Like, 15 shots to just the one, um, which was actually a pretty good save. And we have confirmation that Bala will be joining Malmo on loan in uh, the January window, just for the rest of the season. But now we have Atletico Madrid. Liverpool will be playing Monaco again. So if we win this one, it's a great opportunity for us to get into the top two. I mean... Almost certainly, if we do win this, we'll be in the top two. Because, I mean, uh, if they draw with each other, we'll go above them both. And if they and if either one of them win, we'll go above the loser. So, if we win this, that could be crazy. Okay, here then is the team. Of course, this isn't how they're going to play. But we are doing something just a little different. I decided that I wanted Baran to play, but I can't drop Alvarez. I feel like this, you know, is a bit more better on the counter-attack. Um... The only difference is Van Amersfoort, um, really. If you look at it, it's Van Amersfoort's position is now an extra striker. I feel like we're fine, and Baran is on comeback to defence. I, I think this is fine. I think this is fine. It's just a bit better on the counter-attack because it has better attacking players. Van Amersfoort drops out 
um, being less good defensively. Now, I think the trick... Jesus, he didn't play in the last one, did he? I don't remember him. Um, but I think the trick here is being scared. I need to be terrified because that's how we've managed to win the last ones. I feel like they've got a slightly different team than they did last time. Yeah, if we go ultra-defensive and let's just control this and go for the draw, pick up anything else that we can get, um, yeah, I, th I think... We, we have a chance, but we need to be scared. <laughs> so don't think this that. Think that we don't have a chance. And then we'll be good. Is Alvarez in the box. It's a decent strike. We've won a corner. I don't think it was ever going in, but a corner is a good opportunity. And we may as well have shots. Get us into the game. Feel confident. Ah, because we're super defensive, that's not going to work out. So I think we're going to have to take this short and just play our way. Baran, we're in the box from this corner, is Kielb, who's been forward, and he shoots wide. Oh, no. Oh, great save. Oh, my God, that seemed like a certain goal, but a lovely save that from Kova Pavlovsky getting it forward. Rivaldinho's in a pretty good position. Oblak came out. The cross wasn't the best. I mean, it was on Pavlovsky's wrong foot. Oh god. Oh god, what the hell? That just came out of nowhere. I didn't see that coming. 1 0. I mean, we've come back from goals before. I think Liverpool and the win against Atletico were comebacks. But god. Ah, uh, yeah, that's just an incredible pass from Felix. I don't think there's anything we could do there. And Liverpool are winning, and we're losing. Uh, yeah, all right, if you didn't see that, uh, up at the top, Liverpool losing. Jesus, um, yeah, maybe if he was playing in that last game, they would have thrashed us. But, yeah, look at this. This is just class here. Jesus, good finish. Uh, so, we'll be still close to Monaco. The only problem being that they're the team that beat us, so they'll be difficult to overtake. Uh, but, yeah, we can still go for this, see if we can maybe rescue a 2-2. Um, you never know, but at this point, I'm I'm not I'm not confident. Oh, the hell? Okay, Rivaldinho, finish that, please. Oh my God, Rival, Dino, you should be finishing that. Come on. Oh, oh my God, those are the chances. Those are the chances that we got to put away. Rivaldinho, come on, man. That was a great opportunity. 2-1, one, one goal away, 30 minutes left. That would have been great, but... Uh. Yeah, now it's 3-0. I mean, uh, okay. I think for the rest of the game, I'm just going to go in to our normal formation. Uh, you know, treat it as a test, uh, but... That's really disappointing. Okay, it's going to be Bolly that comes on though, and uh, I will bring on Van Amersfoort. Is that? Yeah, that's yeah, that is pretty much normal. That's really, really bloody annoying. Jesus with a hat trick though, I'm pretty sure. Okay, it's four nil. Um, I think I am going to bring on Adam Shitch just because. I can. Bolly. Oh, too far behind him. That could have been an Adam Schitt's goal against Atletico Madrid. That would have been great for him. But Bolly messes up the pass. Ah, I messed up the pass. <laughs> Stop blaming the players. Um, yeah. Well, he had his eye on the ball. He waited for the striker and then he smothered it. It's really, really good goalkeeping. Alvarez. I mean, it's one on two. But our players are arriving. Ah, oh, but our players are running out of energy. <laughs> Never mind. Ah, right, well, the game ends 4-0. Uh, really, there was a turning point there. If Rivaldinho finishes that chance, it's 2-1 with half an hour to go. Anything can happen. But they go up on the other end. Jesus gets his hat trick. It's, yeah, it's it's a hard one to take. We'll have to take a, ta take a look at the table um, and see where that puts us. Liverpool won their game 3-1. That means they're probably going to qualify. Uh, we now, we're bottom 
four points, same as Monaco, but look at the goal difference, look at that, that means we do need to win against them, I think, uh, it means we need to either get like a draw against Liverpool, and then draw Monaco and hope that Monaco lose it against, basically we need to win one game of these, we need to either beat Monaco or Liverpool, which isn't any easy task, uh, and that's just to get in third place, this is going to be really, really hard, like really hard, this is going to be down to the wire, I think. But now we have to turn our attention to the league, We're playing Vizsla Krakow, who are in fourth place, just two points ahead of us. If we win, we'll be on 26 points, which could be a fourth place, uh, and just three points off, well, two points, uh, well, three points off top, yeah. We have a, a break now, so we can go in with our strongest team. I think that's exactly what we will do, because it's uh, it appears everyone's fit enough, and uh, yeah, let's just go, let's try and win this one. Here is Komen. So lots of players arriving in. Give it to Rivaldinho. Finds Van Amersfoort. And that is a finish from Alvarez. First goal from him in like, the last... Oh, uh, well, yeah. He hasn't scored in a little bit. Both of our strikers have been on dry spells, really. I figured that would be offside, to be honest. Um, but Van Amersfoort gets the assist. Is that on? Seems on. Ah! Oh, come on, you baited me. Uh. Ooh. That's a pen, but a, a well-earned one because that was definitely going to be a goal. Um, it was an advantage, interestingly enough, and the advantage... Because, look, it, there's the tackle. They have the advantage... We gave them the penalty by blocking the goal. So this is just like another chance of us not conceding. He's going to go right. Well, well, you know, okay. <laughs> oh, great tackle that. Can we get a counter-attack? Buran. Oh, too late. Oh, no, no. Yes, there we go. Van Amersfoort is through. Counter-attack has been successful. Is the goal? Yes, it is. Van Amersfoort, a goal and assist. 2-1. Greatness. The hosts have had the lion's share of possession, but after that, it's been really difficult. That was a really bad tackle. That's going to be a second yellow. Right? Mm hmm. And here comes the red. Mm hmm. All right. That was really just reckless from me. I don't know why I did that. Okay, I think the player I'm going to make way is Van Amersfoort. And yeah, whose check is the obvious option to come on? Buran. Go over the. Oh, so close. He's driven in the corner. Oh, go on. <laughs> that was a, a, another goal from Novak. He's been scoring quite a lot this season. 3 1. I think I might go ultra defensive now just to try and uh, get this through. But very nice finish from him running in. Expecting it. Good goal. And at this level, if you're gonna do that, you'll get punished. Not good enough. And this the formation will end the game with uh five at the back, uh Novak going into defence and Lushuj coming on uh to fill in the DM spot and then Baran, Alvarez and Rivaldinho. Uh in fact, I could probably bring off like Rivaldinho or Alvarez. I'll bring off Rivaldinho for Adam Shic, uh and then that's all three subs, I think. Okay, this formation change has managed to shut the game up mostly. I feel like... Oh, God. That was a good chance there. I feel like uh, they still may score, but at this point, if they do, the game will end 3-2. I'm, I'm pretty confident that we've we've come away with the three points here, which is crucial for the season. Can he finish this? Really digging in at the back, but still the opportunity... Oh, really? Okay, well, yeah, I was right. They scored. But those goals always annoy me when it just... It doesn't seem right that it went in. And give it a second. Please. Yeah, okay. I was worried for a second, but yeah. 3-2. We've come away with the points with a red card for 45 minutes. That's pretty good. And that will be where we end the episode. Only four points off top spot. Which is, which is good, uh, <laughs> considering we've been really messing up. I feel like we're getting very lucky in uh, that some of the other teams aren't performing as well as they should be as well. Next episode, massive game for 
for many reasons. We play Liverpool, uh, which we know uh, the, the, we need to win at least one of the two games we have left to even have a hope of qualifying for anything. So that game will be real big. And then, of course, we have Vishalva, who are four points ahead of us at top. So we could be, to be honest, by the end of that episode, we could be in a Champions League spot and top of the league if we win all those games and results go our way. So yeah, tune in for that. I think that's going to be a crazy episode.